Hi everybody, Brian here from quantlabs.net. Today is April 11th, Saturday, 5.57 p.m. All right, so people have been asking how's the performance been on these, this bot. Uh, right now I just did an entire uh, P&L profit loss for everything since March 23rd. Uh, you can see here I got a position log. There's 288 positions taken on. Total profit loss, $41. Um, USTD win and loss of uh, 49, 49%, yeah. Total return rate of change is 30.59%. 30, 30 okay, so that's roughly 31%. We'll leave it in here in the spreadsheet. I'll uh, give the download and test and do whatever you want with the position, timestamp of everything. The pair you can verify that if you want against uh, finance the data if you it's free access for you all to it here's the original price the close as well as the PL and the rate of change for that particular position the set it's you start on the 23rd of March all the way up into including today I think there's only one position taken on so far you can see it's been very tight range bound. So this was actually due to the 4th, uh, April 6th. So as I said, it's been very tight and the futures block's been not been trading at all. That's why I'm looking at the Ethereum market one as well. So right now that's where we're at. Uh, so I've included that. Again, that is with those metrics, let's say 30% uh, right there. Comparatively to other asset classes using bar chart, um, so I'll do a measure of one month. So here we are looking at, I believe this is Bitcoin against US dollar. So Bitcoin's been down 13.87%. So yes, cryptocurrency is not doing too good, but um, other crypto coins are doing quite well. Thank you. Uh, with this bot that we've got so it's negative 13.8 for Bitcoin so it beats that with one month performance on oil um, I believe this is uh, CLK 20 uh, down 37.98 percent the last month to that asset silver just because someone mentioned it one month performance negative 5.76 uh, and that is with uh, SIZ20, future contract. Gold, um, that is again G8CM20, one month, uh, negative 0.1%. And then the euro against the USD, uh, that is, didn't do too well either, 3.29. And I remember I did have S&P right here. S&P X, or S&P 500, the last month it's been right here, negative 3.22. So you can see that this bot clearly uh, outperforms all of them by God knows what. Um, but again, if you need to see the position logs are right here, I'll make these available to you as well. If you see anything wrong, let me know and we'll correct it as well. Thanks for watching. We shall talk to you later. Have a good day.